Hey guys, welcome back to Electrical Car Repair Life. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. If you guys have a BMW, guys, 5 Series BMW, guys, with a six cylinder gasoline engine, I'm talking about engine N51, N52, or engines, guys, N53, N54. Stay with us, guys, and we'll explain where you can expect to find, guys, your uh, vacuum pump. The vacuum pump is also known as brake booster pump, guys. Very hidden. Okay, we'll show you where it's located and what needs to be done to remove and replace it, what special tools you need, and uh, video replacement, okay, uh, will be coming very, very soon on the channel, guys. Now, quick introduction to the channel. Every single car we get at the shop, we make at least 200 free repair videos, specifically on BMWs, we make close to four or 500 videos. Why? Simply because our mission in the shop is to save you guys as much money as we can. All we need in return, please subscribe to the channel and like the video, guys. So we can keep providing that free information now if you guys need to buy any of the special tools we're talking about new pump parts anything like that check out the links in the description of the video below we will share them guys for your convenience so this specifically is n52 engine guys and this engine has been used uh, uh, probably from year 2005 to year 2014 i think in different guys okay in different bmw guys 5 series so uh, let me have everything ready here i need to show you a few things now so now if you have guys okay the n51 or n52 six cylinder gasoline engine which one will be 523 525 528 530 or if you have guys uh, engine n53 n54 okay uh, the actual pump will differ okay but the location will be very close to almost the same with some minor differences guys you will need to remove your intake manifold now if you guys don't know how to do that we have complete video demonstrating on n52 engine guys uh, so check out guys i'll post the link in the description of the video below for your convenience you will need to disconnect your car battery the correct way guys it really matters which terminal you disconnect first positive or negative if you do not know that we'll have the link in the description of the video okay to the video that explains all that why because this is positive wire coming from the battery to the engine starter and this is uh, the alternator guys and uh, you don't want to guys okay touch those wires because you can damage severely your electrical system guys and burn modules and computers now on the back side of your engine okay checking it here this is guys your brake booster vacuum pump this is the pump right here but now guys if you start developing symptoms of hard brake panel uh, uh, weak brakes okay it's because of that pump it could be just a broken hose ours is cracked on the bottom okay let me let me zoom in so you can see it okay it's cracked right there and uh, that crack guys okay is the one probably responsible for that too it could be cracking the holes loose clamp or broken pipe right here that could be another reason as well guys uh, and uh, you gotta make sure that it you follow to make sure you don't have any leaks but that pump guys you cannot remove it from here you have to remove it from the front and now that's where things get interesting because it's part of the okay timing chain system so this is guys the timing chain on this engine okay main timing chain this timing chain is for the uh, brake booster pump this is the oil pump with the balancer so guys there is a special tool that you need okay a holder tool in order to remove and replace that pump and you don't screw up the timing we'll have the video coming very soon on the channel if you want to see the tools there will be different for N51, N52 engines and a different tool for N53, N54. I will try to post the link in the description of the video below to the new tool and new pump. So hopefully guys the video will be helpful. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to the channel for more videos and see you guys next time.